Little Lover is actually simple. It's about love and sex. And the concept for this, I guess, short film in many ways, was to really enhance those core emotions. Most people who had heard the song for the first time really identified with those core emotions. We just wanted to really bring that out visually. I wanna fly. So we're here at the Little Lover video shoot. It's bigger than Ben Hur, <laughs> but it's pretty cool. And I've just had my back done, which is the Broadhurst logo. Looks pretty freaking cool. But come in, we'll take a little tour. And this is actually going to be where I'm dancing for the first time in my life, ever. Slightly nervous. So in terms of the masculine and the feminine, I always had this picture of a male and a female being in this music video to represent that. And you can see in this through the choreography that Jason has me standing quite firm Three, two, for the majority one, of the clip. Action. And that very direct, very upright energy is the masculine, whereas the feminine is moving around me. If I'm a flagpole, she's a flag. And she's beautiful and soft and moving around me the whole time. And as the clip progresses, you can see her literally rubbing her feminine energy all over me as we begin to merge into the one being. I wanted to explore that feeling of, could you be close enough with somebody that you feel like you're actually one being? The first half of the song is very kind of slow and, and sort of uh, yeah, restrained, and then sort of I wanted to present that in the female's movement and sort of keep everything kind of, you know, in pace with the song. And then obviously there's a huge change when the rain comes in and the piano kicks up a notch, and then that's when we sort of bring in these more big, grander moves and uh, really sort of just hang on those big grand gestures in slow motion and make that a real big impact. Not every piece of rain was going right to left. Some, some in the front were just falling straight down still, but there was a sort of gap in the middle area where it was going right to left, but then swirling around a bit, and it created this really interesting energy, which was, which was really cool. It was just like a happy mistake that both James and I embraced on the day. I would have sworn up and down that he had danced before, for sure. Um, and, but the truth is, I mean, I, I taught him not just the choreography, not, not just the sequencing, but I taught him how to accomplish the things that are in the video. And he does such an amazing job, you're gonna think he's a dancer. <laughs> we had this team around me who was so invested in the process that it really became a common mission to create something really beautiful, to create timeless art. The music doesn't feel like it's about me, it's about everyone. And this music video, I feel, really touches the core of that because everybody can relate to it. Everybody can feel the emotion in it and it has this perfect, simple journey that takes the viewer and lifts them to a point where there's almost a euphoric feeling in the rain scene. And uh, it was just a beautiful, beautiful process. Oh,